Greetings, 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 and welcome to Heal Talk Tuesdays with Lisa. It's so good to be here with you, isn't it? Wow, I am so excited. I am so excited because of everything that is happening in life. So why am I so excited? Because I just came back from an incredible conference and it was in Atlanta, Georgia. And for those of you who are following me, you saw everything that I did. Well, not everything, but I shared some of the highlights and there was so much more to share. Now, why am I talking about that? Because in life, you have to make a choice. You either say yes to opportunities or you hold yourself back. Now, that's exactly what I did. I said yes to an opportunity that came in on my way. So let's talk about opportunities. For those of you who do not know me, my name is Aliza Bubari. And over 22 years ago, I healed myself through hypnosis. And healed actually not only just myself, but in order for me not to have my third ovarian cyst operation, I healed through this incredible science I call hypnosis. Actually, I was told by my gynecologist that we're going to go, um, I was going to have my third surgery. And uh, at that time, I used to work at a law firm. And uh, I was truly distraught. And when I went back to the law firm and the HR director saw me in tears and everything, she asked me what's going on. And I did share with her of what is going on. And uh, she said, I'm going to send you to an acupuncturist that she knew. And that's what she did. She sent me to the acupuncturist down on Hollywood Boulevard. Yeah. And... Um, the acupuncturist on our second session gave me a sheet of paper saying how hypnosis can help with ovarian cysts. And that's what I did. I knew a hypnotherapist in Pasadena. And uh, after calling her, having few sessions, actually it was less than six sessions that I had with her, I realized why my body was creating the cysts. And um, thank goodness this time it was benign. And because I had already had two surgeries, um, it was it was difficult. So why am I sharing about this? Because the work that I am doing, the work of saying yes to opportunities, is realizing that sometimes things come to us that are challenging, that are very difficult. And because of that, when I said yes to not only going to an acupuncturist, saying yes to what he said, saying yes to hypnosis, he's saying yes to going to school while, while I was still assistant to an attorney as a paralegal, realizing I have said yes to so many things. Now, you may say those are choices. Yes. Again, yes. But everything in life, we have a choice. So, guess what? The second Thursday of each month, I'm going to be offering group sessions. And this group sessions is going to be taking place right here in our healing center. And if you type uh, group to 818-279-221, 2797 again group to 818 text group to 818-221-2797 you will uh, see a post and you will get in uh, get information you will get an email about our group sessions and this group session in September 9-9 Believe it or not, nine being the number of completion, birthing, beginning, 
how apropos it is that we are doing a group session about women and women's wellness on September 9th. It will be only for 90 minutes. It's in the evening, not evening, late afternoon. So we start at 6 o'clock and we end at 7.30. And if you are anywhere in the Los Angeles area, by all means, let me know. You can even message me right here and get on and we will send you the information. We will send you the link for you to register. So, believe it or not, at the event that I was on the last day, I got to meet a gentleman. Actually, he was there for another meeting with some friends of mine. And, uh, so sorry, talk about texting. That was fast. He was there to talk uh, for a meeting with some friends of mine. And as I was introduced to him, and learned what I do, he said, you know what? We are in the funding and everything. We create apps, all right? And we create apps for wellness. And I'm saying, awesome. So here's one thing, saying yes of being there, saying yes to saying hello to them. It led me to connecting with this person and you never know what comes up because they're creating an app for health and wellness and healing. You may say there is a lot of them. Maybe, I'm sure they have already exported. But why am I saying it? Because, remember last week I was talking about menopause? Do you, did you know, one thing women have not thought about, and I work so many women and menopause and going through this entire transition of what we can do to feel calm so that we can de-stress, how we can put ourselves in that place of inner joy and calm. And I don't know how you do it. It's a $6 billion industry. Menopause, helping women going through menopause. It's a $6 billion industry from not only doctors, gynecologists, pharmaceuticals, from every aspect of it. It is mind boggling that one thing we never thought about is the biggest thing that women go through because it is a life cycle. So if you are here watching, by all means, drop me a line or just share. What do you think? What do you think? Did you know that this is one of the biggest markets for women? You would think that it's gynecology. You would think that it's infertility. Women spend thousands of dollars for IVF and when they are not going through, uh, when they can't get pregnant from every aspect of the pregnancy, from the pregnancy until they get pregnant and everything afterwards. But I never knew that menopause and women's wellness is like this. So as we started talking about this, one, lit, one thing led to another and he gave me his card for me to work. So here's my question. Did you know that I even have an audio recording for menopause? That through hypnosis, you can take control and literally bring your stress factor. As a matter of fact, I have an audio recording for stress no more. You can go to healwithin.com backslash shop and look at all the audio recordings that I have. It's amazing that so many know me and yet not realizing I have 12 audio recordings. I have three books, workbooks, specifically for stomp on smoking, weight, heal thy mind body. Allow me for a second and I'll share something. So, This is the part when we think about it, how we say yes to ourselves from being present 
and realizing that at all times, how we manage our body, how we manage our posture, how we manage stress, and frankly, even saying I apologize for getting out of the handle. It's knowing that how you can just tap within and just say to yourself, relax, release. Relax, release. Relax, release. And as you tap on your chest, on your clavicle, you really are tapping. If you do three times, three is not only you hear it, you feel it, but you give yourself permission to have that very moment. And the same thing can happen when you feel your body temperature rising, when you get stressed, when you get literally go off the handle. And, you know, it's so easy to say, oh, it's I'm having a menopausal moment and I didn't know what I said. I am flying off the handle. Take a moment. Walk away. Take a moment. Close the door and be by yourself. Because at all times, no matter what happens outside, but what we can do to manage ourselves, manage our body, manage your body and your psyche, your energy is all up to you. A lot of people can push the buttons, but how we manage our own buttons, if we can even put it on either pause or out of order and realize you have the right to say that. So one of the things I had in my, in my, um, in my book, Heal Thy Mind Body, it says, take a deep breath and close your eyes and imagine being inside your mind. Notice what that space looks like or feels like. Just being in your mind and when all the thoughts, ideas, every concept, everything from the outside is just attacking and you feel bombarded and overwhelmed, just give yourself this moment and say, what's your sense of this space? Yours. Because this space within you, it has a sound, it has a feel, it has a look, it has a color. Is it angry? Is it frustration? And whatever it is that you are feeling, validate it. If you are sad, be sad. If you are angry, be angry for you behind closed doors. And at that very moment, if you have to fume, go ahead. Be frustrated. And at that moment, once you all that do all that, just go relax, release. So imagine a switch in that place, like a switch. And it can be any size or shape. So you can do this with me. And this switch allows your muscles and your mind to shut off temporarily and let go that you can relax even more deeply. It's like a fuse. When that fuse, you know, when the lights go out, you go check all the fuse boxes to see which one is off or which fuse is off. And then you push the fuse back on, right? Every single house, every single residence has a fuse electrical panel. And the first thing, when electricity goes out, instead of saying, oh my God, lights went out, check the fuse box. 
check that electrical box because sometimes it just snaps this way for whatever reason and all you have to do is once you check it go push it back on so once you turn off the switch because you can also turn off the switch and allow all the muscles relax and it relaxes instantly when you turn everything off you give yourself time to relax and release and find your switch and when you are ready turn it off and you can count 1001 1002 1003 I'm okay and when you say I am okay you are giving yourself permission to handle it because it is your hand and you can turn the switch back on when you are ready and with that Remember that you're in complete control and can, turn, and can turn it back on whenever you want. And by doing this, by taking control of the control panel, by taking control of the electrical panel, by taking control of your mindset, you are doing your own reset. Hmm? It is incredible. When you realize you have total control, not only on your body, not only on your mind, not only on what you feel, but you have the handle for your own electrical panel. And you know how electrical panels have different rooms? This is for the kitchen, this is for the bathrooms, this is for the living rooms, this is for the pantry, this is for the backyard, this is for this. It's amazing when you realize there are so many compartments within you. Your heart, your body, your mind, your feelings. As a matter of fact, your hands, if you have pain how to switch it off and for just temporarily relax <sighs> you are a magic and if you unt until now you have not realized how much magic you have that no matter what circumstances you are in no matter what challenges you are going through you can turn off all those switches and just be one with yourself and as you swallow your saliva as you breathe you just give yourself 1001 1002 1003 that's as long as when you're at a stop sign you're supposed to count not 1001 1002 1003 but 1001 1,002, 1,003. That is enough time for you to relax and release. Tap three times. Relax and release. Hi, Sega John. I don't know why you can't see me. Uh, Sega John, you still cannot see me because looks like a lot of people are on please let me know can you not see me anybody else cannot see me i've been speaking all this time okay all right say that jen are you here okay well apparently you can't hear me either <laughs> I'm not seeing any response so once you're done there is another switch in this room the switch slows down and quiets your thoughts 
and I want you to uh, perfect hi Becky there is something going on at Facebook it's only on mobile desktop is out I don't know why all right I don't know if it is my desktop or somebody else's desktop is it my desktop that it's out okay <laughs> so you know what this is called challenges challenges in life so what do we do turn it off some people can see me some can't maybe that's exactly how it's supposed to be so what do we do with challenges laugh it off I swear to God sometimes you know how we go into fight and flight or pause or freeze you know what when you are pausing laugh it because there is another switch and that's called I can do whatever I want so take a few moments enjoy this deep relaxation and that is one of the relaxation techniques that I have in my book as a matter of fact I have plenty so we come back to menopause I wonder what it is that we are pausing you know when we are sluggish when we don't feel good when we don't like our body we just want to pause a lot of things how apropos that it's menopause and uh, we just want to pause just like now I paused so a silent pause or a loud pause a real pause we are saying I need time for me and for that starting September we are we started in August so September second Thursday of the month September 9th we are offering our um, it's usually the first Thursday of the month but because of Labor Day we are pushing it to September 9 9 9 2021 so 9 9 21 wow 9 9 it adds up to a three you know what let's do this we're doing a group session by all means there's a small little fee for that and come in quarter to six we'll do a little bit of a networking six o'clock we'll start our group session it will be not more than nine people wow nine people in here so if you would like to come in for a small minimal fee text 818 text group to 818-221-2797 let's get together we'll do a little bit of a um, networking and a healing group session it is a support system for women coming together and we can be talking about women's wellness so I look forward to seeing you text group to 818-221-2797 or you can just message me we'll send you the link we'll send you the information and I want to say do not forget to take a moment even at this very moment 1001 1002 1003 pause say yes to opportunities say yes to you say yes to realizing that you do matter all right today is going to be a short day and until next week I bid you goodbye so many opportunities coming our way I want you to be a part of it so God bless you and may the universal light surround you bye bye Thank you for being here. If you want to check out some of the testimonials that I've got, click right here. But if you want to go back and watch other videos from a week ago, two weeks ago, even a year ago, click.